Former Major Leaguer Jeffrey Hammond is here at Room to Bloom with this big project today. The Players Trust of the Major League Baseball Players Association. They're involved in this playground redevelopment project. So Jeffrey, this is the first stage of it, but what brings you out here today? Tell us a little bit about the Players Trust and what y'all are doing. Well, having the All-Star Game in Miami this year is exciting by itself. And uh, we've never activated around the All-Star Game. This is the great year to start. Uh, Melissa Prasad, the director of the Players Trust, you know, she came up with a great idea. Um, let's find a community that needs us. Let's find, let's, and, and, and we land on Opalaka. And uh, we would like to just embrace the community, and it starts with the children. You know, and, and, and coming down here to Opalaka and, and Room to Bloom and, and be able to build a playground, because our, 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 our mantra is volunteerism. You know, and we're action team, and, and so we, we, we promote and we, we encourage folks to help others. And, and just the gratification of working on a project together, hand in hand, without any, how do I, I don't want to use the word, selfish motives. It's important. It's an important message that we all need to share. We embody that here with the players. and. and Having Cliff Floyd and Charles Johnson come on down, former Marlins, former world champion Marlins. Um, they both have foundations here in the community, but they were also were very active when they were current players. So for to have the opportunity to invite some former ball players to be a part of this opportunity and this and this unveiling and the design day today, it's important not only to us but also to them because it lets them know that we did pay attention, that the that the associations always going to be part of the fraternity and we always never know when we're going to lean on you for something big and that's going to help the communities that we're involved with. And that's something because you say helping the community and the players on their own help the community and part of the players trust help the community. Yes. So this is something, just tell us, even when you were in your playing days, just how important it was and is to give back to the community. I mean, we're very blessed. I mean, that, I mean, it's one thing to be blessed by the, by the Father with your abilities, but also be able to navigate. Uh, uh, I mean, it's a minefield. Life is a minefield. I mean, you never know when you're going to step off that cliff. You never know when you're going to step on something that's that that's going to derail you from what, 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 you know, what your destiny is. Um, fortunately. We are able, we still share those stories, and we still have had ups and downs, but be able to create an access and, and share those stories and share that testimony. And, 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 and we might see something that that 12 year old child doesn't see yet, and we can educate him, or we can teach them uh, what hard work and, 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 and teamwork and, and, and sacrifice and, 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 you know, there's a lot of adjectives that, that baseball principles of baseball brings out in all of us. I mean, you know, you know, you, you play to win, you learn to lose, but you always got to come back the next day and be ready to play. It's like life. No matter what happens, you got to stay in the game. Now, there's some fields that are better than others, and if we have an opportunity, whether it's not only in Miami and, 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 and we have 30 markets, but we also have, we're an international game. And that's the beautiful thing about baseball. Players are from all over. All over. And so we have that ability to reach one and teach one. And if we can help one, hopefully that one helps another one. And then and that one it just keeps aggregating. So so our impact would be much broader than just one person doing it alone. So if we come together as we are today and what we plan on doing during the All-Star game this year. I know this impact here in the Opalaka community is going to be just as you know, gratuitous to us as we are to them for just allowing us in here. All right, Jeffrey Hammond, going off the board because I cover a little pro wrestling. Okay. So I'm going to have to I'm gonna end it with this, Jeffrey Hammond. Does Jeffrey Hammond have a favorite pro wrestler? Superfly Snooker.